girl Sassy MC here, and I would like to welcome you to LIB Litus News 231 YouTube channel. LIB Litus News 231 is the place where you can watch all of your political news, entertainment news, and sports news. To stay informed about the latest news, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification button on your screen for more videos from Liberia, Africa, and the world at large. Ready? Now that's you ready? You know the whole order. The fast key for the key bridge. I'm going to go. I'm going to Hello everyone. Thank you for coming. Thanks for joining us. Every one of you have followed this case from the beginning when uh, when we were attacked. April, I mean February 20, 22nd of this year. But let me start back over and say something. I'm a son of this soil. I was born in Liberia, Douala. Grew up in Cinco. In our household, we all, we've had minimum 10 to 11 people living with us. It's my younger sister, my older brother and I. We're the three from my mother. But she's always brought in people from the family. She's always taking them, change their lives and giving them something better to live for, who now lives in every way all around the world and are good people and are making changes in other people's lives. And that's the same thing she was doing for Chalo. And this happened. Chalo was murdered and the murderer is out there. The murderer is out there. Nobody is saying nothing. We have people that we trust in, in our system, in our government. I love this country so much and they're letting us down. What is this? Politics? Politics? That's just what it is. Find a murderer. What are we doing? Went through this whole thing and who's the freedom, what's that, the freedom radio? Freedom FM. Freedom FM, are you with them? No, no, no. Okay. Freedom FM. It's like the voice of this whole thing. They have the information before the investigators even call us. They will, they will preempt. It's like they, they call in the gameplay of what's going to happen the next day. They have information they haven't even released yet that we are not even supposed to speak about. It is true that your mom has been charged with murder? Yes. From your liberty, your mother has been charged with murder. That is true. But I'm not finished yet. Let me finish. Okay. So now we're here, but you know what though? We're taking it to the next step now. We're gonna be playing on an even field and some of these people who's been out there, been ruining, tarnishing my mother's reputation, it's about to be on now. The battle is where this is her playing ground and our lawyers are ready. We are all ready and some of those people who are part of all of this, they come in on the stand and we will see them. If you talk about battle, what do you mean? You mean in the court. Okay. Legal battle. How many charges um, levied against your mom and the three others that you've heard from your lawyers? M U R D E R. Murder and conspiracy. Also giving false information to the police officer. It's funny when we speak about false information, given that. Listen, Liberia. You know who's responsible for this. But the talk in the town is making talk off. We're gonna talk off real soon. And the world will know very soon. We're going to the next stage now. My mother is innocent. And they you that is innocent. AC 
It's innocent. And take get you, it's innocent. My family is innocent. All that my mother has ever done is, is provide service to the Liberian people. So many people have come from under her that she's given back to this country. And here we are. That's the way to say thank you, right? Why? Because of politics? Because of politics? Just so you guys know, and I was told not to speak about it, but I'll speak about it now. Okay? In our household, there are different people who support different parties. My mother never come to us and say, you can't do this and you have to follow our party. I, for once. I was supporting President Weah when he challenged Erlen Johnson Sirleaf. And I've supported him all along. You can look through my social media and see. This government, anybody say something about CDC, you got a problem with me. And this is, what, this is, how, we, this is how we are repaid from what we've given to this country. Your mom looks very sick. Have you she's not sick. She's solid, she's strong, and she's ready for this. So how negatively this particular case have affected your country and your family? We're devastated. Her reputation. Yes. You have this, 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 again, freedom. I'll tell you something. There's a guy named A.B. or something who hosts a certain show, and he's missed a loud mouth and say, I don't care what happens, and I can go to court. Your day in court will come. As soon as we're done with this, we'll meet you in court. So what have you been informed um, the next steps by your lawyer, sir? Is your mother still in the building or has she been taken to the police? I don't have all that full information. So what's the name again? So what's the exact Newell message? Scott is my name. What's the exact message you wanted to send forward? We fear for their safety. As women in this country, they need to be protected. We fear for their safety. And their safety is in the hands of the national police in Liberia. Thank you. It's okay. So, okay. Can you name that? Yes, Scott. Yes, Scott is the son of Councillor Global Moses Scott. And she has been charged. She has been charged of murder, conspiracy, and raising false alarm to, or giving false alarm to the Liberia National Police. And so we hear at the headquarters of the Liberia National Police, and of course, she's still in the building. And while we are here, we gonna do all we can to ensure that we await the arrival from the building of uh, the constable Richard. In this case, now that she has been charged, for murder, conspiracy, giving false information to the police. You come from the judiciary. How does this work now for her? Will she be beat up or she'll be held in detention? So, Emmanuel, thanks for that um, question. Well, as with regards to murder, murder is a first degree felony and it's not a billable crime under the Liberian law. So, definitely. If that is so, we expect the former Chief Justice to be detained until a trial begins. So I, I, I bet today she will be going to court. If all goes well, if the ends for me there, then she will be going to court. All right. So thank you so much. Richard Sekeman is our judicial correspondent who understands the legal proceedings, has been able to give us a tip that um, in this light, in this light, um, she will not be bailed for because it's a first degree felony, which means that no one can file in any bill for her. So she will be detained if all goes well. And if all goes well, it means that she could be placed behind by. And where that could be, whether it will be the Monrovia Central Prison or an ordinary jail. Certainly, it's the Monrovia Central Prison. That will be the Monrovia Central Prison? Yeah, sure. Because that's the only place they have now. You can carry her to any ordinary place. So, her destination is obviously the Monrovia Central Prison. And so, Richard has confirmed that just in case she will have to spend her first night at the Monrovia Central Prison, which is a saw beach. And so, as it stands now, the former Chief Justice Councillor Musu Glover Scott has been charged for murder, 
conspiracy and giving false information to the police, which is not a billable offense, but rather she will be in detention. So as it stands now, the time is 11 minutes past one o'clock, and of course, court closes by two o'clock. No, right? it's, no, it's open. The mother said the court where she might be going will be open close to four. Okay. So meaning if she is taken to the court, she be taken to the court. When she is taken to the court by four o'clock, following proceedings from there, she will be spending her first day, her first night behind bars at the Mon uh, the Monrovia Central Prison. My name is Emmanuel Gablije. So this is K News Online, Cool ninety one point nine. And of course, Richard Sekerman, who is our judicial correspondent, is the head of this team, who is providing all of the necessary analysis, giving us bits and pieces of information as we do all we can to give you updates on what is actually obtained here from the headquarters of the Library of National Police. This has been a uh, so much guarded headquarters of the Library of National Police today. So we will take a break and be back subsequently as we keep following the process leading to whatever that could be coming up and we'll be getting them as it unfolds. Thank you so much for watching. Keep following Kid News Online. Keep following Kid News Online as we go ahead. You can see for yourself how well guarded the headquarters of the Liberia National Police has been. You can see for yourself. And so. They want to green. Thank you so much for watching. Hi, it's your girl Sassy MC here, and I would like to welcome you to LIB Litus News 231 YouTube channel. LIB Litus News 231 is the place where you can watch all of your political news, entertainment news, and sports news. To stay informed about the latest news, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification button on your screen for more videos from Liberia, Africa, and the world at large. Oh, 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 oh,